this is the anaerobic setup that we use in class. Uh, there are there is an indicator that we would put into the anaerobic uh, container with any inoculated plates or surplus plates that we're not using in class. Um, and it is a strip that will show if the anaerobic environment has been reached or not. It starts out white and uh, upon incubation, if it turns to pink, then that means uh, that the anaerobic environment has been reached. If it does not, that means that you need to reseal the container and uh, try again. So you would put one of these in there. You would put the gas packs in there by opening one of these um, sealed containers, okay? This large container needs to have three in there. I marked it on the lid and all of the little containers, the anaerobic containers that we have uh, do have the markings on the lid. This has condensation because I had it in the refrigerator. Uh, this large container holds up to 42 plates and will be used uh, whenever you open a new container of plates and you don't use the rest of the ones that are in the contain in the package you'll put the rest of the ones that were not used in the container put the three gas packs in there put the indicator in there and then you're going to close it make sure that the seal is clean and intact you need to make sure that when you put it on there it sits flush on the top and you're going to close opposite sides together. See how that popped up? The lid popped up when I closed it. That means there's a good seal. Then I'm going to do the other two. And um, since these would be unused plates, I would put them right back in the refrigerator. If I had inoculated these plates, I would put them into the incubator.